Welcome back to What's Inside Family. I hope you've seen the main channel video where we saw what's inside of a hydro flask. This is the first time we've done something like this. We're selling something with our logo on it. These are basically really, really good water bottles that are metal that have a vacuum sealed double wall inside of it so that things can stay cold for a super, super long time. And I know there's a lot of memes about like Visco girls and all that stuff, but we just really wanted to make our own. And these are beautiful white with our logo on it. We still haven't taken pictures of them. I still haven't, whoa dog, you wanna go out? You need to go outside, buddy? She rings the bell whenever she needs to go to the bathroom. There you go, see ya. We need to build a website. And in order to build a website, we need some pictures. These are the only two that we have right now. And in about a week, we're getting the shipment of like 3,000, like 1,500 of each one which is so many. First things first, we're gonna go to my friend Shay's house. He has a channel called Great Scots, and he also has a channel that he's been a huge part of with. It's called The Piano Guys. You've probably seen them. He's the videographer for The Piano Guys, and they've done some amazing things. And so, as I'm sitting here thinking, who can take some pictures that maybe are better than just using my iPhone, I thought of Shay, and he said, yeah, come on over. Hey, my car is cold. It doesn't usually get this cold here. Look at that frost on it. Look at that windshield, it's like pure ice. That doesn't happen very often where we live here, but I have to park this car outside because in our current rental, we don't have a big enough garage for the Roadster, for the other Tesla, and then some of our stuff that we have in there. So the Honda Accord, the gas car, it can sit outside. It doesn't need to charge overnight. And here we are. This is their house right here, and you might recognize it from a viral video when they first unveiled their dream home to the internet. I think it got like one and a half million views. They, this is like the fourth or fifth home that they've built over the years of their marriage, over like 10 or 15 years. And so they are pros and they have a really good eye for design. So if we're gonna do a photo shoot, I think this is a good spot because their house is beautiful inside. This doorknob is something else, look at that. Hello, Hello what's up, nice short. So not only did we come here because Shay is incredibly talented, but look at this kitchen, look at the lighting, beautiful. I mean, this looks like a church. It's so beautiful in here. I love it. And you've got a really nice camera. What is this? This is a P7R3. It, it takes photos. Actually, I usually film video, but uh, I wanted to see if I could take pictures. Then uh, I've never actually taken pictures in my life. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, today's the day. What are you thinking for a couple of good shots? Okay, we're gonna do the, uh, what I call the, the hand model shot. I don't know if it's really been attempted before, <laughs> at least in my house. Awesome, that was great. Nailed it. I'm so good at this. Ooh, this is gonna be a good shot because you've got the arched ceiling in there. Mm -hmm. Both of them lined up. Oh, that is good. This... I mean, doesn't that make you want to drink from there? I, I would only want to drink from there. The water would be so pure <laughs> and cold. Do you want maybe you personally holding them like a sure. So this is a beautiful kitchen. Everything's already white. Even the refrigerator is white. And so probably would have been better if we would have had like black water bottles, but maybe the white on white looks really good. What do you think of that? Ooh, that's the one. Put on a different lens. This one is really cool and it's my favorite. Like, look at these two shots right here. It's like you go yeah. back and forth. He, somehow he stood in the same spot. I did. He got the same shot, except the Christmas tree lit up in one. And I, did, I, did, I did that on purpose, because I wanted them to look different. It, that's a, it's a technique that's called- a photography trick. It's a, yeah, it's been, uh, I take years of learning it. <laughs> Whoa. Did you make this room look so beautiful because you built a bunch of homes, or is this just something that you just came up with? So this, this, is, this is our second home we built, so you learn a lot from your last house. Yeah. Um, but we wanted a room that was just like matte black. So the piano, matte black, mm -hmm. walls matte black. Look at this, with the natural light coming in. Okay, I think that's gonna look good, just like right here. Okay, the last shot that I think that we might need is, he made this video about a month ago that is pretty awesome, it's their entertainment room. And they use those really cool lights that gamers use that are on the wall. So I haven't seen their media room in person, but I like it. Those aren't, wait, those aren't the same ones that gamers use, those ones are like square, okay. I love this, it looks so much cooler 
in person than it does on camera too. Look at all these squares up here that change based off of this. Don't they change based off of the TV? Yeah, they do. But the blue is perfect. It looks good at the water bottles. You've got these that people can sit here and eat popcorn and stuff. After posting our first video, the biggest suggestion was to do a drop down screen with a projector in here. And do you like projector screens as much as TVs? Well, here's the deal. So this is a 77 inch OLED and I love OLED technology. Like they're right. just amazing. But there is that occasion where you think, you know, where you could have more people, where you have the drop down screen for a movie night. That's 77 inches. It looks so tiny against the wall. I know, so that's what everyone says. So <laughs> it's not as bad. Like that's seven feet away from that TV. So it's not as bad I as I mean, it maybe looks. if you put it and mounted it up on the wall a little higher, it wouldn't look so small. Yeah, well, I'm not gonna do that because that, that means you're you're looking up, and that's a big that's a big sin in the really in the home theater world. Yeah. You Ooh, know. see, I don't know the sins. Yeah, that's one of the cardinal sins. Yeah, you don't want to do that. Yikes. Okay. So if you want to see, I guess this is 1.0 of their movie room. We'll put a link in the description, and then stay tuned, subscribe to their channel, and you can wait until they come out with 2.0. How long is it gonna be till you're, you've got 2.0 ready? Like probably, a month? Yeah, probably the next 30 days. We're gonna try to Ooh. try to do this right. So we got some big Perfect. stuff. All right, big fancy door. Thank you very much. And uh, check out the great Scott's channel. Or if you just need product photography done, he's an expert. Yeah, just come to my house. Just give me a call. <laughs> we'll put the address in the link in the description. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, 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 okay. we won't do that. Don't come to his house. All right, you guys are awesome. See you, Dan. Thank you very much. Thank you for the Christmas treats too. Here we are. These are the bottles. They're all arrived. Finally, we made them 3,000 water bottles and somehow we need to fit them in our garage. So we moved out this Roadster, we moved out that Roadster, and uh, hopefully it's enough space. This is one of four giant pallets. Oh my gosh, that is a lot. It's happening. Here we are. Oh, so close. It won't go lower. It's pretty solid. Oh! <laughs> Let's go inside and try to go to the left over there a little bit. That way we can park one of the cars in here, hopefully. Oh my gosh. This looks like so many water bottles. This looks super sketchy. Somehow it's okay, but it looks sketch. Oh, go! So close! Almost made it. Whoop. This is pretty exciting. This is the first thing that we've ever actually sold for you guys. We always get asked to do merch. We always get asked to like have t-shirts or hoodies or hats or anything. I wanted to find something that is incredibly useful and something that people need. It stops you from using tons of plastic water bottles. It's reusable. Man, it is madness at our house. We've got that giant truck bringing all the water bottles. And then this truck just pulled up at the trailer because they're picking up our old piano. So we sold our other piano, like our blue one that we've had forever because we bought a, an upgraded piano for our new house. And we're making a separate video all about that piano because it's pretty incredible. And we bought it with the piano guys. So that video, stay tuned, it's coming soon. And then also this little thing just uh, ran out of electric energy here. So we're giving it a bit of a charge. So this is the blue piano that we're getting rid of here. There's the bench for it. It's going. It's going. Sad, to, sad to see it go. I'm a, I'm a little sad because it has like tons of personality, but I'm excited about that one. The one's gonna be great. Yeah. That is a job I could not do. I would totally crash this thing. Nice. Look at that, guys. We got him. Oh, the dog wants to come back in. You need to come back? Hey, you're back. Oh, you want a treat now? Do you need a treat? Because you went to the bathroom? Is that what you're looking for? Yeah, oh, there's the treats. They're inside of there. Is this what you wanted? There you go. Good girl.